This week, we unfortunately have to say goodbye to and explore the Opportunity rover on Mars, who for 15 years has been just roving around and taking pictures. He's like any young European, basically. <laughs> but he has been doing so under extraordinary conditions. And unfortunately, it looks like his mission has come to an end. Sorry, his or her mission has come to an end. For more than a decade, Opportunity has been an icon in the field of planetary exploration. This is coming to us from the Associate Administrator for NASA's Science Mission Directorate. Teaching us about Mars ancient past as a wet, potentially habitable planet and revealing uncharted Martian landscapes. Whatever loss we feel now must be tempered with the knowledge that the legacy of opportunity continues, both on the surface of Mars with the Curiosity rover and InSight lander, and in the clean rooms of JPL where the upcoming Mars 2020 rover is taking shape. Opportunity explored for 5,352 Martian days, 60 times longer than it was expected it would be able to do that. And we've got some some of the photos that were taken. We can't go through all of the photos Opportunity sent back because it sent 217,000 photos. But there you're seeing its initial sort of shell that it descended in before it bounced along the surface of Mars. We've got a very close up photo. That is a photo of tiny little Martian rocks. I love Martian rocks. It's 1.2 inches across, magnified. Those are just little rocks on Mars that we can see as clearly as any other. How awesome is that? Like, and this was a camera that was Look built that. before 15 years ago. Like, it exactly. got there 15 years ago. It takes what, like nine months to get to Mars? At least, yeah. Um, and that's, uh, I just made that up, but no, no, I, I, that's always what I hear is nine months. So, oh God, good job, wow. Henry. But uh, wow, great but B-roll, like the, Sophie. The photo, the photos are amazing. They, they digitized, what camera did you have 15 years yeah. ago that could take Wait, that, that well, many megapixels in it? Keep going with that, that's awesome. That's Let's all we that. had, that's, <laughs> that's all awesome. it is, that's that's the B-roll. I wanna see it again. All right, John wants to see yeah. it again, Jeez. No, that's awesome. We, I know that we, we've talked about the other rovers and everything, and I'm already trying to get somebody on to talk about the 2020 Mars rover. We sent a car to another planet, everybody. We're capable of amazing things. Stop thinking so small, humanity. What? We sent a car to take pictures on another planet, and it did it. It took selfies even. It did it even though this is an absurdly dry, absurdly cold, radiation blasted wasteland. It rode around for years <laughs> taking photos. It's being blasted by sand and dust storms on a constant basis that we're expected to corrode and wear it away in just a few months. Instead, it has lasted and lasted and lasted. It is an amazing testament to what humanity is capable of doing when we believe and we put some resources into it. And yes, I know it can be a little bit difficult to take these photos and say exactly how this is gonna benefit an individual human in an individual circumstance. But the scientific drive that leads to things like the Opportunity Rover is why we have all the amazing things that we have as a species. How do you really feel, John? That's how I feel. I love Aww. this little rover and I hope that someday we're able to recover it. It's Valentine's Day. It should be it's in a, a, a museum someday. It belongs in a museum. <laughs> I was just thinking that. Uh, it does though, it belongs in a museum. Well, John, the next car that goes there can bring it back. And hopefully, put it in hopefully. A museum. Thank you very much for watching this clip from the damage report. If you liked it, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and ring the bell on YouTube to get notifications of our new videos. And of course, you can catch the full damage report live every weekday at 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific on TYT Network on YouTube TV.